What's up guys, Dr. Dan back here at Beat Fitness where we teach you how to move your body and live empowered. That's our motto, right? Look us up on Facebook or Insta or wherever you see us at, right? So we got this dowel rod and we've went through a number of different movements. Today, we're gonna to talk about one of my favorite ones that helps us to develop good core stability. All the exercises, if you work on engaging and crunching that core like we did, in our abdominal engagement. Remember how we did that deep breath in, breath out, crunch that core a little bit, keep that core nice and tight. We're gonna practice the dowel rod movements overhead with some quick movement, right? So we're gonna start off slow and I'm gonna show you how we do this, right? So we're gonna hold this dowel rod right at our hip and we're just gonna swing it backward we're not gonna do the overhead rotation. We will do this at some point. But right now, today, we're gonna to work more on the lateral shift of weight, or the, excuse me, the front to back shift of weight through our hip hinge, right? So we're gonna hold this down low, and we're gonna raise it, and we're just gonna bring it back and forward. Inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. You see I'm starting off nice and slow, okay? So one of the things that happens is we get older and we don't exercise, we get stiff and we forget how to move our body and we forget how to transfer forces through our pelvis down to our feet. That's why barefoot training is important so we can develop good little nerves in the bottom of the foot, right? So we've got dowel rod, we're gonna start off nice and slow and we're gonna focus on that hip hinge and we're gonna gradually work into a little bit more extension into the body, reaching those arms back, boom, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Now, some of you, we don't want this, you might get a little low back pain if you are extending the low back too much and not shifting the hips or extending the thoracic spine enough so what we don't wanna see is this. I don't want you to reach back and pinch your lower back. I want you to work at developing thoracic extension and that shift of weight through the pelvis so we don't hurt our lower back. So I want you to practice starting off nice and slow, shifting your weight forward, excuse me, backward, forward, boom, and then gently reaching, right? So about 20 reps, gradually increasing the amount of extension that you can produce, right? It's a great exercise for the anterior chain of muscles, the core, the hip flexors, the quads. Great exercise for the posterior chain to help contract and pull you back, concentrically contract as these muscles lengthen, right? Great for anybody who sits at a desk all day and we're sitting, we're typing, and our shoulders get tight, and our hips get tight, and before you know it, we're hunched over, we can't walk anymore, right? Don't let pain run you, you run pain right out the door with exercises with the dowel rod, right? So 20 reps, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Gradually getting a little further back each time. If you guys have questions, check us out on Facebook, Instagram, bfitness.com, turatchiro.com. We'll see you guys in the next video. I'm Dr. Dan. Live empowered as always. Take care of your body.